But in today's video, I'm specifically going to show you how to use Bank Novo. Subscribe if you haven't already. Welcome back to another episode of UXpreneur. In today's episode, it's something very important to us all, banking. Now, I personally use a couple of banks, Blue Vine and Bank Nova. Both of these are online banks that partner with community banks that are local somewhere, a brick and mortar bank. The benefit of using these banks is that there's zero fees to maintain a balance on those institutions. And there are hidden perks of using them. For example, Blue Vine integrates with QuickBooks. And I've been using QuickBooks since 2008 to do taxes and accounting for my business. And so I want you guys to be aware of those things so you can take advantage of some of the automation that I do too. But in today's video, I'm specifically going to show you how to use Bank Novo. This is because Bank Novo has a sweetheart deal with Stripe to integrate and have zero fees for up to $50,000 worth of transactions. So taking advantage of this while it lasts is a huge savings to you as a startup business because Stripe actually charges a percentage fee on each transaction. So avoiding that can really help save you some money. So with that, let's grab that popcorn and dive in. Last time we talked, we were talking about Stripe and in Stripe, there's going to be an area to connect your bank account. In today's video, you will need your EIN number. So now that we're on the dashboard, we need to go up to the settings tab and go down to the business settings and go to external payout accounts and scheduling. And here you can see Middlesex Federal Savings is the local bank that Bank Novo uses. and. I've connected that uh, by clicking add once upon a time over here. And I have the payout schedule set to automatic every day so that I don't have to come back here and manually do it. All right, so that's where our bank account is. So again, go from home to settings, down here to external payout accounts and scheduling, and add your bank credentials. Before you do that, you're going to need to go to novo.co and I have a link in the description. I get a little $40 kick that supports this channel and you want business checking and so you're gonna click get started. You're gonna fill out your business email and password and select no if you're you're not a, a Brex customer uh, and you can put the referral code from the description down below and you can click get started. For me, I'm gonna log in. You're gonna need your EIN number to set up your account by the way. All right and so now that we have successfully logged in, the good thing about Bank Novo is that you can actually add applications here, okay? Like Novo invoicing. I use that to invoice a business that comes in and it's free invoicing and the money comes directly into Novo. And then of course Stripe. Connect Stripe to your Novo account to get paid up to two days faster with Bank. With Novo Boost. I don't really experience the boost personally, but that integration does exist. You see, I have it connected and they have just like a little bit of a discount right now. Connecting to Stripe integration is only part of the process. Make sure that you're set up to get paid in your Novo account by clicking the button below, logging into Stripe and ensuring that Novo is your destination bank account for Stripe payouts. And we just confirmed that. So you could actually set up your Novo account and go and set up through Stripe as well to go ahead and connect those two. Essentially, it just takes us there to our Stripe and to our payout section we were just at and make sure that it's connected. It might take some time to approve it. And so that's how to connect Stripe to your Bank of Novo account. All right, gang, that concludes our video on how to set up your Bank of Novo account and connect it to your Stripe account so that you can withdraw funds and get yourself paid. So I hope you enjoyed that video. Click the like button if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't already. Ring the bell to be notified of future videos, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.